Welcome to the home of the scalloped hammerhead. Observing these bizarre looking animals in their home give scientists the chance to understand exactly what's happening inside a shark swarm. You want to dive with big sharks and lots of them, you come to Cocos Island. Cocos is a remote island in the Pacific, 300 miles west of Costa Rica. When you tell people that some sharks basically have a home, you get interesting reactions. Throughout the year, hundreds, probably thousands, of scalloped hammerheads traverse the open ocean to arrive in Cocos, forming huge schools. 100 feet from the surface, sharks aren't the only animals making their homes here. This coral reef is like an apartment complex for thousands of living creatures. Different hard and soft corals create their home by attaching themselves to the ocean floor. And they provide a habitat for countless other species, including a variety of fish and invertebrates. We're just beginning to understand why scalloped hammerheads form such extraordinarily large schools. It could be to meet potential mates, find refuge from predators, or maybe they're just social. I've observed many of these sharks moving in unison, sometimes as close as a body length from one another. If you pick out one group or a pair, you'll notice that many move in rhythm, like synchronized swimmers. I have spent over a decade studying the social behavior of these gentle giants. I'm confident hammerheads are smart animals that can work together and socialize like we do with each other in their home beneath the waves.